Hey guys, welcome to my gaming channel. This is yet another video about video interpolation and it's not about converting 30 frames a second to 60 frames a second. This is about your own personal use. If you prefer a gameplay video that runs at 30, but you prefer to watch it at 60, you know, the, with the advantages that brings, you know, the visuals on the visual side, then this program I'm gonna explain to you um, that I've just downloaded, it's cost me eight pounds it'll cost you similar dollars you know if you want to buy it i'll uh i'll show you the web page and i'll give you a link in the description to this uh thing it's called dimitri render now basically it's it's a filter it's an external filter that works in conjunction with mpc player now when you play a 30 frames a second video i'll give you an example Kills all three operations on Marla Graveyard, which is an online match I had recently with my live commentary. I was contemplating uploading like highlights of all of these. Uh, but let's go into the properties, right click properties. Details. 30 frames a second, that's what you're looking for. 1920 by 1080. It's also upscaled with my capture card. Because it run, that game itself runs at 720p on PlayStation 3. But my Recording is 920 by 1080, 30 frames a second. Okay, so let's let's press play and have, just have a look at this. Just before I play it though, make sure you've got 1080p or even 720p 60 selected, and you you know you, your computer, you know your internet can handle it, and you can see through 60 fps of what it looks like to see this. Watch this. There's a bit of a delay at the beginning, and then it and it. You know, you can see the 60 FPS difference. See it change? There I am now, down there. Hey guys, welcome to another round of operations. Fantastic operations game mode. PlayStation 3, can't see that properly. <laughs> a bit of a stutter there but as you can see if you can't see the difference there between 30 and 60 frames a second then don't carry much in this video but that's by using this external filter here it is Dimitri render 3.001 okay downloads you can thing is when you download it it'll give you a trial for 30 days so you just be a even even movies, you know, you can watch, um, see what they look like at sixty frames a second. It's you know, it's 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 pretty unique, you know, because I mean, films I'm not so bothered about, but gameplays, yeah, I'm bothered. You know, there's I can't be dealing with thirty frames a second. It's got to be sixty for me, and this is all happened until since I bought a gaming PC. Um, so if you download this, you know, link to this this um, website will be in the description. Download it. And the thing thing is, it'll ask you to install AV, AVI synth, which is all well and good, you know. And once you plus, once you've downloaded this and installed it, um, you click on a 30 FPS video in MPC player, and then it will uh, play at 60 frames a second. But when you install AVI synth and you've already got MeGUI like I have installed, then you will find MeGUI the AVI synth script won't work. Support. Well, it won't work properly. So what I did is then uninstall the, the, the uh, AVI synth from this program, um, and I found that Dimitri Render still works because there's an AVI synth already installed on your system if you if you're running Media UI. All right, I hope you understood that. <laughs> but um, this is just a program that gives you really smooth playback in videos. I'll give you an example of a day out to Blackpool Zoo. And me and my two daughters, my daughter's boyfriend, and my little grandson. Yes, I'm I'm uh, in my late forties. That's how old I am. So anybody wondering, you know, I think Sakuraba's um, <laughs> like my friend Sakuraba Nat one nine eighty two has let people know I'm a granddad <laughs> a few times. See, watch it change. See the difference, sir. That's the only thing. It, there's a bit of a delay, but there are the lines at Blackpool Zoo. This is film on my phone. I've only got a, a Galaxy, a Samsung Galaxy, and uh, ten, it was filmed at 1080p, 30 frames a second. There's my daughter Sally there. 
And he's got his meat. He's, he's been waiting for that for hours on end. He's not bothered about people watching him. He just wants his meat. But you can clearly see the difference there between 30 and 60. And this is just playing a 30 frames a second video with Dimitri Render installed. Ashley, let's, let's um, go to options. Now, player, external filters. Internal filters, you know, it's external filters. Once you click that, there's your Dimitri Render there. Right? So, um, you don't need the x86 if, you, if you're running a 64-bit system. But I just, they're both, that's how it came out. They're both checked. And um, basically that's that's Dimitri Render and what it does. Um, give it a try, you know. If I liked it that much and uh, I bought the program. And there's another thing you can do. If, um, let's go to a, this is Fight Night Champion at 60 frames a second. Have a look at this. Give it a chance to load up. Two the one there, huh? That's a flush shot, banking away those body shots. See it change? And now just wasting oh. away some time. That game is so bloody annoying when a computer constantly grabs you all the time. It pisses me off. <laughs> but anyway, that was a 30 frames a second video I'll, I'll show you. And you just watched it at 60. There we go, 30 frames a second. And all these, um, you know, all this... All these techniques and you know video interpolation has made, been made known to me by a guy called Irex, and it's thanks to him for um, you know. So I'll get, leave a links to it. It's a brilliant media UI tutorial and get get playing, get um, playing your 30 FPS videos. But when you want to make a, your videos stand out on YouTube, then I suggest you convert them to 60 with media UI. Or if you don't want to bother. Um, converting and uploading and just want to watch 60 frames a second then you can do what I've just done here all right I'm Pepper 66 this is Dimitri Render 3.001 you can download it for free try it for 30 days and if you like it it'll only cost you eight pounds or I know it'll cost you um, it's well it's less than eight eight pounds but it's, it's a similar price for the, in dollars because I don't believe the pounds not worth shit right now <laughs> Oh god. Anyway, give it a try and uh hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.